another video, right? So this one's been pretty highly requested. It's gonna be my nighttime routine. What I do before I go to bed, like what my nights usually consist of. So I did a morning routine and you really seem to like that as well. I'm gonna be doing an updated morning routine as well soon, because a few things have changed. But if you do like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you've not already. And let's get into it. So I usually tend to wind down at about 10 o'clock, half past 10. Um, I'll get my last meal of the day at around half past 10 at night. So I've had all my calories before then. And I'll have usually a protein yogurt bowl. So we've got some fat-free Greek yogurt, some fruit, some apple, raspberries, um, a protein bar, and then some like high bran as well just for like slow releasing carbs, a bit of fibre. Yeah, I'll mix this all together, have this. So then before heading upstairs to bed, I'll usually always pour myself like a massive glass of water because I don't know about you, but it's the worst thing when you wake up with a dry mouth or like you wake up in the morning and just dead thirsty. So it's always good having some water in your room or next to your bed. I will head into the bathroom and I'll start by whitening my teeth. So that's the first thing I do. I actually got them off eBay. They're like six or seven pounds or something like that. But they've been they've been working great, you know. So you just put them on. It's just a strip. You just put them on before you brush your teeth. You leave them on for about half an hour. Just let it sit. Take it off. Then brush your teeth. And I do it probably like two to three times a week. You don't make your teeth sensitive or anything at all. Just a cheap, easy way if you want that nice Hollywood smile. Um, yeah, it's really helped for me. After that, I'll always apply a moisturizer. So I don't usually do loads of skin stuff, but I always moisturize, that is the most important one for me. I'll wash my face and then moisturize. This one is just a Dove Glow, so it's got a bit of a tan in this one because I don't want to be dead pale, right? Honestly, if you're living in the UK, you'll understand me like, we don't have that much sun, so always pale, and I don't want to go on the sunbeds. So I've got that one with a bit of tinted tan in there. Then I'll head back into my bedroom and I will sit at my desk and write out everything that I need to do for the next day. I just think it's always good to get everything set out ready for the next day. So you're going in with a bit of a plan, like you're not wishy-washy, you're not going to just sit on your phone or get distracted in the day, like go with the plan plan will help you reach your goals as well. So I'll also affirm my goals, what I want to achieve that day, even a few long-term goals I'll write them down as well and I'll also get all of my clothes ready for the next day. So that is a, another decision that I don't have to make in the morning because it's already been set out for me and it's just going to help me have a good start to the day. I think it was, I got the thing from Mark Zuckerberg and he always wears the same thing every day, so that is one decision he doesn't have to make. Obviously, I'm massively into fashion, so I'm not going to be wearing the same thing every day, but if you're in a rush in the mornings and you don't know what to wear and you're dead indecisive, get all your clothes laid out the night before. It'll help you a lot, honestly. Right, then I will go and check my phone. I'll go into an app called Audible. This is basically just audio books. So there's loads on there, there's fiction, non-fiction, biographies, and I'll just listen to a bit before I go to bed, before I brush my teeth, just to relax me and gain a bit more knowledge as well. It's a bit of time where I can begin to wind down and I think audiobooks are really good for that as well. Then I will head back into the bathroom, brush my teeth, get rid of all the whitening stuff on the teeth, and I'll also use mouthwash. So. I always brush my teeth for at least two minutes, guys. Honestly, you wanna take care of your teeth. You don't want them going yellow or being stained from coffee, wine, all this other stuff. So, 
I've got an Oral-B toothbrush, it's electric, but it's not one of the ones that's dead expensive. You can get one from like Superdrug or Boots. Really good, use mouthwash, just some Listerine. That seems to work for me. So I usually do tend to go to sleep at around 12, midnight, and I try and get at least seven hours of sleep a night. That is what works best for me. They say six, between six and eight, don't they? But seven seems to work pretty good for me. So I try not to go on my phone or watch like TV before bed as well, just because of the blue light. And if I do like watch TV, I'll put my anti-glare glasses on that I've got. It just blocks the blue light. So it helps you get a deeper night's sleep and you want a good night's sleep, especially if you're training hard in the gym as well, because you want it for that recovery. Sleep is so important. But yeah, that is my nighttime routine, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see any other routine videos, like maybe another morning routine, um, I'm going to be doing a workout routine, skincare routine maybe, let me know down in the comments. But yeah, that is usually what I do before I go to bed. Subscribe to the channel if you've not already. Turn on the notifications as well because YouTube can be a little bit funny. But I'll catch you on the next video, guys. See you in a bit. Can't you see? You're my delight, lady.